Hello folks, Joel here with another Leo creation, and today we'll be looking at my version for the combination of Golly and Liwa. First off, this thing is a misproportioned kind of a pile. I will freely admit that right now. It's just got parts all over the place. But this is using all of the parts from Liwa and Golly, including their powered up forms. So all the parts from the set, plus the parts needed to power them both up. As you see, Lee was golden mask is in the main part of the torso where the head normally goes, while Golly's head and mask is on his left shoulder. There's a reason for that, and there is a reason for that. The Toa combinations that I'm going to be doing will not be all six into one. It's going to be two teams of three. So this guy will be completed once I get Kupaka. But for now, he's just kind of a... Uh, well, he's a master of jungle and a master of water, so master of swamps. In his right hand, we have his main weapon, which is a staff. Basically an amped up version of Golly's trident. The tip having two blades and a golden harpoon in the middle. The skull spider just being a hand guard. I want to use all the pieces, and that's really the only thing I think of to use them for. On his left arm, we have both of the guns mounted to his wrist. And he uses the yellow, green, and blue energy swords. It's just kind of a short sword dagger. On the back you can see basically all this kimbles and bits. The gear function only works for the right arm, although it is kind of difficult to get back there. On the hips you have extra friction joints because he's gonna need the friction, along with the three gears on each side of his hips, which was supposed to make it easier for the gear gimmick to stay in place, but I'll show you why that didn't quite work in a minute. The backpack is basically two wings that can fold out. They don't do much for flight, but in this mode they're mostly used for swimming. So the turbines, they provide a backpack propulsion. I thought it seemed like a good idea at the time. Now, on the gear back here, it can work, but it is really stressing. The gear in The ball joint in the shoulder just, well, it keeps giving up and there's not enough friction in that arm to hold it up. Again, I thought the friction would be more useful in the legs. And as for the legs, right now they're attached together for their tail formation in order to aid with swimming. They do separate into basically webbed feet. He's very, very front heavy and definitely top heavy. So he does fall over fairly easily. So, so he really does benefit from the extra feet. The flippers can also be put on the backs of the feet. Grand you have to move the pegs to actually fit on there. But at the very least, they do help deal with the weight a bit better. So he's not so front heavy. Now he's about equally as back heavy. And unfortunately, the wings are a bit too small to actually be of much use. But at the very least, he can almost fly. And that is Lego Bionicle, Liwa and Golly combined. Now... This is a mess of parts, and hopefully when you go I can get something a little bit better. I was really dedicated to a certain idea, and it didn't quite work out the way I had hoped. So to build this, you need Liwa, Gali, and the parts from Protector of Jungle and Protector of Water that you need to power up both of them. And if you think you do a better job than this, which I'm not going to lie, I don't think that'd be too hard to do, I would like to see it. But thank you folks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you next time.